Good afternoon, you guys. This is take two for some reason. Um, the first video uh, said that it couldn't load because the information wasn't saved. So what do you do but start over? So this is my yarning life with God Rocks 2107 and my name is Esmeralda. And I'm here to show you a winnings, a finished object, and a whip, and to introduce um, a few channels to you. <laughs> so the first thing is my winnings. This beautiful caring skinny cake, my first skinny cake. It's a weight three and it's got 795 yards. And it came with this hook. It's a G hook um, or a 4.0 millimeter. And this came from Michelle from Mother of Boys and that's the name of her channel. This was a birthday giveaway for her oldest son. And um, I won and it came all the way from Canada. So <laughs> that's very exciting. Um, let's see, my finished object is a baby blanket that I made for my cousin. She is having her first baby. We don't know what it is, but I thought blue was safe. <laughs> I like blue. I'm not a pink or red person, but I like red when it's in my patriotic colors. Pink, I don't think pink is an ugly color. I just, I'm not a pink person, but it's a pretty color. And I'll still work with it. But I figured since we don't know what it is, that blue could go for a boy and a girl. This is in the linen stitch and I bordered it up with a small shell stitch and I used um, an H hook for this so it's nice and done and then my whip is a one of those uh, beanies made out of you know panels this yarn I don't have the uh, um, band with me but it's called Cozy Toes from Hobby Lobby, and it's very bouncy. I love it. It's for socks. But I thought it'd make a nice beanie, and since it's already bouncy, you know, I feel like it's gonna have, I just dropped my hook, that, um, that stretchy, that elastic effect that knitting has for a hat. I am going to reach down to get that hook. <laughs> and I'm using a 3.5 millimeter hook. And I don't know what the, the letter for that is. This is from my uh, Hobby Lobby hooks that I recently got. Anyway, that's what I'm working on. And my other whip is still, of course, my son's blanket. Um, I'm hoping to be done with it this weekend. Uh, let's see how that goes. But anyway, okay, so the few little channels that I wanted to introduce you to that are new to me. Um, the first one is... Penny from Pen Leanne's Creations. I think she's adorable. <laughs> um, she's very informative too. She likes to uh, give you lots of information of things that she finds out uh, with crochet or any other little thing. And um, I love to hear her talk. She has this thing where she says, how are you today? I hope you're having a beautiful day. It is the cutest thing. I love to hear her say that. It makes me so happy. I don't know why, but it does. <laughs> anyway, um, you will enjoy her channel. So, and the next one is Crystal with a K from uh, the Yarny Chicken and Crazy Cat Lady. She is so sweet as well. And uh, she talks and shares a lot about her grandmother also because she crochets and I believe her mom does too. But uh, Crystal likes to garden. She's got her chickens and her cats and everything. And um, she shares a lot of stuff in there. And she is um, also fun to watch. So that's that. And then Pam. Pam is someone I've watched for years. And she had stepped away from YouTube for a little while. And I followed her wherever she was because uh, I enjoy Pam. <laughs> she is very talented and very crafty. And right now she's back on YouTube and she's uh, her channel is uh, 
about journaling her fiber arts. So right now she is spinning and dyeing yarn and uh, she's doing an amazing job at it. So anyway, if you are into uh, yarn dyeing or uh, just dyeing the fiber itself before it's like made into yarn, um, she's fun to watch. I enjoy watching her do that. I enjoy watching her spin. Um, she also uh, paints. Um, she's an excellent drawer. She's an excellent artist on many things. And uh, I've learned this from her, from, you know, her previous channels and everything. But right now her focus is on her fiber journey. And uh, I enjoy watching it. I don't know how to spin. <laughs> so, but I enjoy watching it. I enjoy um, watching her and listening to her talk about her ideas and uh, like I said, I've watched her for a long time, so I enjoy her company very much. And I will leave um, everyone's links down below so that um, you can go and check them out and uh, see what you think. So, anywho, um, this is short and sweet. I, I'm hoping to get some more things done. Um, there's been a few setbacks for many different reasons, and but I think I'm good now, and uh, I'm getting those creative juices going so anyway i hope you guys are having a good morning afternoon evening whatever time it is wherever you are at and uh, hopefully you'll see me soon with some more finished objects so you guys have a uh, good weekend and uh oh no it's not the weekend it's always the weekend for me i'm a stay-at-home wife homeschooling mom <laughs> so i don't know why i thought it was saturday today it is not it's monday <laughs> i hope you guys have a good week ahead and you'll see me soon hopefully bye